Hello there, Sagittarius. This is your friend Dharma Jane here to do your monthly tarot scope for you for September 2018. Can't believe it. Oh my goodness. All the information you need for a private reading or getting in contact with me is in the box below. Without further ado, let's get started calling in guides and angels, calling in anyone from the highest good that has a message for Sagittarius. Stop. Past, present, future. Okay, recent past for Sagis. We have... Sagittarius wanting to be single but can't be single. Or, you know, this doesn't even have to be single. This is this is somebody who, okay, let's take love out of the picture because I don't see any cups here at all. Okay, this is the nine of pentacles. This is somebody who doesn't need to ask anyone for help. You know, you, they might genuinely need help, but they can take care of themselves without if they want something or need something they can just go and do it and this is like and look at her hands you know this is like a longing desire to be there but these are both the you know two of the vehicle cards in the deck and they are both in reverse like it is not happening in the recent past for Sagittarius this is just something that is, has been wanting to happen but just it just it just wasn't you know and it's like I'm so disappointed because you know five of cups that's disappointment I'm I'm so disappointed about the past because I I, I have this realization now that I ha I think it's like you know I have to do it by myself I want to be like I have to do it by myself but I feel like I can't I feel like I want to say I can't why are both of these vehicles in reverse please yeah because something is something isn't there because there's there's no celebration this isn't this isn't happening obviously so it's just saying so the Sagis have probably been trying to manifest it for a while continued man repeated manifestation and it's just not I mean this this is like the most devastated mermaid I've ever seen in my life she just can't even believe that it hasn't happened yet Where is the union? You know, where is the the contract that gives this person the independence? Because I feel like this is an adult. It just feels like something was broken. Some kind of way things were supposed to be was broken. Because coming into your present... Whoa, we three kings. Holy snap. That's three kings right there. That's a fire sign, an air sign, and a water sign. The water sign is in reverse. So the water sign king might be the one this realization was about. And then you have the king of fire, that's Sagittarius. And this king of air could be someone who's giving, like, juicing up power. But, you know, I'm looking at this card sitting right here. This might be maybe a little, this is my sneaky peek card. But possibly the air sign might be, this air sign might not belong in the picture. But yet there he is. But look at how this other king is looking at him. You know, this doesn't have to be masculine or masculine. You're talking about a, a, an extreme master of air, fire sign, an extreme master air sign. But here's this water sign over here. Like, <laughs> want to be like, what about me? What is the, what do we need to know about this king of fire? This is somebody who's ready for change. This is somebody who is bringing change no matter what. What do we need to know about the king of air?
this is someone who I want to be like give strength to I I want to be like it is empowering and that's what I was saying is like puffing up this person over here because this is like sees someone who has been broken or needs strength and then gives her this like cup of love so it might be an air sign doing like watery type things or like an air sign with like a watery moon but who's the um king of water then And, and here's the vehicle again. So maybe up here with this chariot in reverse, like this was being stuck like I can't move away. And I'm devastated about it. But then now you're able to. And you're able to quickly. But there's still this disappointment. I mean, that's the five of cups twice. And here's a disappointment card, four of cups. Oh, I mean, this is a power couple. We have the king and queen of earth. And then there's the decision. I think this is the decision to end a power couple. And when I say power couple, this is like matching energies. And it's, but it looks like in the reason past, you really, really, really wanted to. But like now that you did, you're the saddest mermaid ever. Because coming in from your see, but look, bam. I think once you get past this, I mean, you have this Ace of Cups. Because you make, I think you make the choice there for love then. See? Oh, you can't see. See, there's the change. This, when we're looking at you, what did you want? We have you wanting this change. And you're peeking over at this air sign. And here is this. Here's the change, and there's victory with that. And all of your burdens, I mean, they get lit on fire. They get let go. You get the change that you're looking for. With an emperor. So maybe that's why this air sign, maybe it's not the king of air, isn't necessarily an air sign, but it's an emperor. Somebody who, like, has authority. Right, because don't we normally see the the knight, uh, the king of air, someone with some kind of that yields a sword? I mean, right. And here's your change. Right there, it is. I don't know how that happened, but I'm missing a card. Maybe that's all that wanted to come out was two cards. Make the cho make the decision. Right here it is. I think you you get to choose to have this cup of love. You get to choose to bring this tower about, but that's why I'm like, but I was like, oh, because it is a power couple. It probably is a family. But it looks like back here, that's like the only thing you could think about. And you were just devastated because you were independent, financially independent enough to get yourself out without help. What is the what is the Ace of Cups? This is a new start that is gonna work. Might be a new start at work. So like a new job. And maybe that's what does this, right? That's what gets you where you need to be. Bam. Bam, and then you get your ace of swords. So that's this like new path. This, that's that's longevity. That is clarity. That is like knowing where you want to be. So that's awesome. All right, Sagis, that's all I have for you for September 2018. Uh, please do like, share, subscribe, and until next month, have a good one.